Okay, people, it's a little hot out here. We're in uh, Alabama in the month of August, so it's hot, man. It's hot as hell. I'm not going to even lie to you, and I'm sweating, man. So uh, I'm going to try to make this as brief as I possibly can. Um, today's topic is Asians, Asian hate and propaganda far as the media is concerned. Uh 84-year-old man uh, was knocked down by a young black man and he ended up dying as a result of it and so uh the interview or the the um the footage of it went to nbc or abc on dateline and um during the interview asian people was asking black people not to um commit uh, certain hate crimes against them and you know, this is a very sophisticated uh, game that they are playing, uh, Caucasians and uh, Chinese people. Now, we all know that China is running America now, financially, uh, but I did not know that they controlled the media, but now I do. And uh, I'm looking for America to be a communist country uh, in the blink of an eye. And so when they're the hammer of communism come down. You know who it is going to come down on. It's going to come down on us as black people. So they already setting this thing up, setting the stage for black people to be uh, an exodus or extermination of us off this planet. Okay. Um, during the uh, interview that NBC did, they had an Asian male on there. And he said that... Uh, he want to give a message out to black people to stop uh, committing hate crimes against Asians. Last I checked, it was a white boy that went in the massage parlor in Georgia and shot everybody that he could. Last time I checked, it was a 29-year-old Asian man shooting at a six-year-old young black baby. Last time I checked in California years ago, a young black girl put food on the counter at an Asian market. The Asian woman told her to leave. She placed the uh, items on the counter, turned to walk away, and the Asian Korean woman shot her in the back of the head, killing this young girl. So don't ask us not to be committing atrocities against you all. You all are committing uh, atrocities against us. And uh, I see how uh, Asians... And Caucasians like to flip the script when it comes to black people. Black people, if we are not careful, every bad thing that they've done to us, they're going to try to wipe it out the history books or going to try to act like it never happened. They're trying to replace the black struggle with what's going on with the Asians now. So every so many years, they have another thing that they do to take attention away from the black struggle. Okay. And so we are used to this. Black people are not stupid. Seriously, we are not stupid. We're going through a lot right now, but we're going to make it. And so to the powers that be, whether it be Asians or the Caucasians, it is a universal God out here. And the wheels of change are moving. It's a gravitational force that's, being, uh, that's happening right now. And it ain't nothing y'all can do to stop it. Killing us ain't going to stop it. All these little tricks you trying, it ain't going to stop it. What you're doing to God's people, you will pay for it. This your silverback gorilla signing off, A to the B. Peace out.